this is very pie here. And today is Saturday! Um, as you will notice in the title, it does not say a month of monstrosities because I am taking a day off. Um, at this current moment, we are playing through three horror games. Visage, The Beast Within, or The Beast Inside, and um, A Song of Horror. And unfortunately, everybody who comes and participates in those particular games are all busy today. <laughs> And yesterday, I could not stream because we went to the movies to see the new Halloween film, which, by the way, loved it. Can't wait for the third and final film. Halloween ends next year. Oh my god! Um, I'm just excited to see how they're gonna do it. Um, and hopefully this time he'll... Um, oh wait, never mind. No spoilers. Anyway, I can't wait for the next one next year. Um, so... Today, we're taking a break and we're gonna go back to our regular Saturday morning gaming... Um, category, where I just pick a retro game, retro-inspired game, or a sim, a Sims relaxing game, and that's how we play Saturday. Like you used to back as a kid on Saturday morning gaming, you know what I mean? So that's what the Saturdays are all about, and so we are back with Eastward. Um, for those of you, I know it's been a while, um, those of you who just are tuning in, the first two videos, um, two and a half... One of my videos, something happened, and I had to break it up into two little mini segments. Um, you can catch those on my YouTube, uh, Vicious Berry Pie, same name as my Twitch. Head on over, you can check them out. The game's really good. Um, I haven't even raged out once in this game, and for me, that's like big shocker. <laughs> uh, this game's a lot of fun, though. Uh, Chucklefish really knocked it out of the park with this one. Um, but basically, the story is we've been living underground because it's believed that the surface had ended, there's no life up there, it's vape, it's, uh, dead, and blah blah blah, and so, this little, I'm a digger, and the opening video shows the digger digging and digging and digging, and the job of diggers is to dig and find old relics from the world above that have been long lost, um, and sometimes you get lucky and find people who have been put into sleeping chambers or something. Anyway, one of them happens to be that little girl that is following me around with the white hair, except she's different than most humans we found. She is having, like, weird visions, seems to have a split personality, and now has powers. She can shoot balls of light that can stun enemies and light up um, bioluminescent objects, which is really fucking cool. Um... And then, of course, the main character fights with a giant frying pan because he loves cooking. Uh, there's also um, a game within the game. Um, there's a game in here called Earthborn, and it basically makes fun of... It's a, not makes fun of, but it's a spoof on Earthbound Dragon... Dragon Heroes... Dragon Quest Heroes, or Warriors, excuse me, and um, Final Fantasy Adventure. Uh, it's a spoof on all three of them combined. It really is. Like, the artwork is literally Dragon Quest. The characters are all named like they are in Earthbound, and you move around on the map like Final Fantasy Adventures. It's so funny, and it's really good. Uh, it's called, like I said, Earthbound. Anyway, so we finally reached the surface. She, We got banished by the mayor of the, uh, of the um, underground, to sent us on Sharon, which is a underground running subway train, which they don't know what that is. At first, they all seem to think it's some kind of big beast. In reality, it's a fucking subway train. <laughs> so we got on it and rode that to the surface, and now we're on the surface, and it's fi it's beautiful. There's life up here. There's towns. There's people. So we just arrived at our first town. Sorry for the long-winded in introduction. I just really love this game, and it's been about a month since we've played. So, we are at the Hunter's Cabin, and, um... This is my last save. Okay, so let's load this up, and let's fucking do this. Hold on one second, guys. I think I just saw a trailer or a preview for another Army of the Dead universe expansion. Hold on. Are you serious right now? <gasps> oh my god, that's him! <gasps> oh 
Oh my god, baby, we have to watch that. It's a prequel to the Army of the Dead. Sorry, I'm really excited. I Sorry, guys, I didn't mean to break out of my stream. I just saw a... a we, Zack Snyder. I have a mad love for him. The Justice League. I don't care what anyone says. I love his DC movies. Anyway, he just... He's expanding this universe called The Army of the Dead on Netflix. And it was really good, but there's so much happening in it, it's fucking nuts. Anyway, there's a prequel coming out this Friday called Army of Thieves, and I'm really excited. Um, so I, I just, I needed to share that. Um, anyway, okay, so. Oh, that's right, we have to go to the ranch. Which I believe is down here somewhere? see we're like pushing off oh my god is that an old traffic light or something this game gives me like the last of us vibes without having zombies everywhere what was that bug got something out of him. Interesting. What is that all, what was that all for? There's nothing over here. Okay, the bug dropped something off his back, and that's two, two of them I've picked up. I wonder what that is. We'll have to look into that after. Maybe it's material I can sell. So, we meet to get youngins. Youngins? Doesn't John look a little older than you? Well, you're a hell of a lot younger than my daughter. <laughs> Sorry, pulling up the stream on my phone. Which I know I should have already had pulled up. Sorry, guys. Anyway, you folks here to help... We sure are. John's a super special awesome digger. Digger? What's up? What I need you to do is simple. Corral these blimp pigs into their pit. Oh my god, they're bloated pigs with dragonfly wings. This is... I love this game. <laughs> this whole damn castle's been uppity at a start. Damn near broke all of my fences. Mongrels may look sweet as soda pop, but make one of them mad, and oh boy, you're in for one hell of a ride. Better you leave the little missy here with me. Hold your horses. Those mongrels may look sweet and soda pop, but make one of them mad, and remember, I better leave a little one. Oh, right, I have to instruct her to... Okay, so am I crawling him into there? This is stressful. I don't like this little mini game at all. Shit. They kind of just like take it, huh? They're just kind of like, all right. Where's the last one? Oh my god, he's of course he's all the fucking way down here. No, no. <coughs> Come on. 
Got him. It didn't get any of them mad. One, two, three, four! Five. That's it. That's all of them. Well, I'll be. Not a bad job, y'all. Right, old boy, but herder you are. That'll be it for today, then, boy. The things are so much fun. They're just like those pot crabs at the Sunday Side Ranch. Pot crabs, eh? Sounds tasty. They're so good. They're a pot croc aisle specialty. Making my stomach rumble like a hell crazed beast you are. Why don't we head on us back to fill up on our tongues? Uva's probably got dinner cooked up for y'all already. I love this. We obtained the Plumping Ranch Seal of Approval. Oh, that's so cute. And that's clearly they've adapted some kind of new form of writing because that is not <clears throat> English. I don't know what that was. I want to go down here for a second. It looked like I could go for... Oh, no, there's not. Okay, it looked like there might have been another pathway, but there was not. I thought there was a way to run. Is this where I broke the... Yeah, okay. Off we go! Let's go ahead and save it. I don't want to do that again. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This isn't where I'm supposed to come back and fill up my tum-tums. I think we're supposed to go back to the town. But it's so far away. Why did they make me go all the way, like, live all the way up here if I have to take this long way back into town? It doesn't make any sense to me. How frustrating. Such a long about long way around. <laughs> Yay, we're here! <laughs> oh, it'd have been nice if there was another fucking way around. Oh, is this that token thing? Yes. Upgrade my bombs! What? Okay, that was dope. Bomb box expansion. Oh, I don't have the parts we need. I used it on the bombs. That was worth it. It was worth it. And what's this one? Quick stock? There we go. Play Earthborn. I don't have any tokens. Let's play a little Earthborn. Strong enemies incoming.
Lucky Bucky. Okay. <gasps> Slimes. Dance works. Okay, good. The slime is... Okay. Usually the slimes in these kind of games are, like, weak to magic, and none of my people do magic, so... I'm kind of cool with the monkey just doing his own thing. If you tell him to attack, he doesn't really understand that. It'll be more dangerous, and the monsters are more fierce. So these exclamation parks are points are all places that I need to get to. So let's go here. And then we'll go down and then to the left, it seems. She hadn't done that, buddy. Nice. Merchants got confused. Oh shit, Merchants almost dead. Oh, okay. Fuck, I don't have a way to heal him. That was coming. this run of Earthborn. Shit. Oh god, thank you. revived. Alright, let's 
let's do this. A monkey, a monkey just attack. That's all a monkey can do. stronger than I thought we were. The monkey reaches up, the monkey gets a little smarter. to be honest. Okay, now where are we? We are off the map now, bro. This is cray cray. Oh! <laughs> Decreases, which is good because will is what powers up the uh, defense to magic, I think. But unfortunately, again, I don't have any wizards or magic users on my team in Earthborn, so. Doesn't really help me. Ooh, who's in this cave? Let's escape. I'm curious. But at least we know it's here. Ooh, we failed on our, uh, our attempt at escaping. Okay, well that's fabulous. Thank you. 
Okay. Yes, teleport to Whistle Pass. Alright, let's try this area over here again. Oh. Let's try this slash and see how that works. Oh, we got him on fire. Here, guess that means you're looking for me. Oh, what a funny joke you've just told. But everyone knows that priests are all belly middle-aged baldies. Priest. <laughs> Wait, you really are the priest here? <laughs> yup. I mean, uh, who would have thought that the priests were seeking would be this beauty stuff? Oh, it's a girl. I don't understand. Silk shop. 
Ooh. That wasn't pretty. Oh god. He's horrifying. Strong enemies incoming. Now while I'm here, bitches. Seems to be only cause interest for them every turn. I like that. Let's try that. I like that I don't need to be near a teleporter to teleport. dropped in. <laughs> Heard you were quite the dynamic force at the ranch, but this Jasper fellow's not so bad either. This town, is it? Is it real? I may just be falling in love with it. Gotten much lively with this young man around here. Two young men even. And of course, pretty little Sir Leek. 
I've got something very important to think about. Very important. <laughs> oh, up there. Ah, oh, you're back. Entire as the wings of a bird, I'm sure. Dinner's all right about it. Come, let's eat. Plunged it into the bowels of that great piece of machinery, laying bare the secret passage the evil mayor had kept hidden for many a century. <laughs> Key of Destiny. Oh wow, that's that sounds so cool. The Key of Destiny is none other than the great and holy rod John ripped from the back of the giant pot crab. I just came up with the name myself. Oh, not bad, is it? But back to the story. You see, what no one could have expected, no, what no one in their wildest dreams could have envisioned, was that at that exact moment, the evil mayor would rear his ghastly head and corner us in the tunnel. Oh, no! It was then that I knew what I had to do. With a great and mighty yell, I screamed, Run, you two! I shall hold back this heinous fiend! Hey, I don't remember this part. <laughs> That was cute. How long is he going to keep talking? <laughs> and just when we got those two together for dinner, at this rate, Uba's not even going to get a word in with John. They're playing matchmaker. Emily, go get that Jasper fella and bring him out here, would you? What? But why me? Get someone else to do it. You and him were getting along sure as syrup earlier. In fact, I heard you say more to him than you've ever said to your old pop all year. Ugh, seriously? What do you expect, you old fuddly duddly stick in the mud? How could you and I have anything to talk about? You want to say that again, young lady? Emily, dear, this isn't about you, nor is it about your father. This is about Uva. This is Uva's big chance. Come now, be it, dear, wouldn't you? Ugh, I see what's going on. All I've got to do is get Jasper out here, right? I'll do it, but I'm doing it for Uva, not any of you. Ooh, this family has some drama. Jasper! Jasper! Oh, Emily, you're just in kind. Come, come sit. I was just relaying a tale of our great adventures underground. Come out for a sec, would ya? But I, I haven't finished the story yet. Oh, pish and squat, just get out here. What's this? Why are you all waiting out here? We want you to tell us your story about Pot Croc Isle. Heavens! You do? You, I think, I think I'm falling in love. Now then, where would you like me to begin? Ah, oh, yes, how about the part where I verbally accost the detestably evil mayor? But, like, did you? Because... I don't remember that. Oh my god, that's so cute. Yeah, hold on a second. You, would you like to come to my place? I mean, it's not, it's just that it can be quite dangerous in the mountains at night. So I thought letting Sam sleep at my place might be better. Oh my god, her tits are huge. Can we, like, notice the fact that the pixels are making them just bouncy trouncy? Anyway, follow me. My house is just north of the water. All right. This is a Snapchat. Sorry. I don't know why I got distracted all of a sudden. Anyway, follow me. My house is just to the north of the water. North of the water, they say. We're to the north. Winter is coming. Stop. 
the same game, Christopher. I know. Here we are. Come in. Come in. Aw, oh, she gonna let us stay over because she wants to kiss some of that sweet daddy. Poor thing. Must have been so tuckered out. John, let me handle it. So sweet. <laughs> She's going to grow up into an amazing woman. She is so cute. Let's just let her rest for now. Don't worry. I'll take care of her. Wh what? What are you three doing here? What? What happened? When did you three get here? We've been here the whole time, dear. Yep, since you put little cur curly Q's sweet little head on that bed. Initiate the plan, girls. Plan? <sighs> What's happening? I don't like this. I'm very uncomfortable and I feel like something bad's about to happen. Your battle uniform, Uva. You need your battle uniform. Battle uniform? You... You want me to wear this? Hee hee hee. You look absolutely stunning. Just like me when I was young. But it's so... So inconvenient. Do I really have to wear this? Don't be naive. And don't be yourself, either. Yes, you must be nothing but darling and sweet. And helpless as baby bird. A baby bird? Got you. Now you, naughty you. It's ever so cold. Oh my god, they are trying to play matchmaker. <laughs> oh, I can't take it. I got shivers down my whole backside. Say it again. Say it again. Oh my, it's ever so cold. Wow, we diggity, you still got the stuff, sis. That boy's gonna fall over head over heels for your moves like that. Enough! Run along now, Uva. You mustn't let that boy get away. This is ridiculous. John! I tried to find them in my jean pockets yesterday. I literally checked the jeans I wore to work and they weren't in there. No, yeah, hopefully they still work. Apparently my earphone chargers went through the washer and dryer. But you know what? I had a Pokemon cartridge go through the washer and dryer as a kid and it came out just fine. Except for the artwork. The artwork came out a little fuzzy and half washed off. That was very sad. My poor red version. My blue version was great, though. <laughs> My favorite one. It had me out. These lights, they're pretty bright, yeah? I installed them myself just last month. Uh, I mean, no. <laughs> I didn't do it myself, of course. I asked uh, Bowman to install them for me. You did install them yourself. Own that shit, girl. We lack strong, independent women who can take care of themselves. I mean, yes, I'd like to stay here, but 
I also want to go explore. It's my first time on the surface, bitch. I want to see the whole world. Yay! Welcome, Killer. That's okay. You're my only viewer who's been here in the last 46 minutes since I've been streaming. So, I've just been talking to myself and enjoying my own company, which is fine, because I love this game! <laughs> we could build a little boat there, grow wheat in the field in the spring, raise a chicken or two. <coughs> oh, oh my. Is it, did I say it wrong? Oh my. Is it ever cold. Oh, it was really good. I can't wait to watch the next one next year. Octopus. Yeah, we wound up really enjoying the movie. We can't wait for the next one. I'm going back to the town on my own. I mean, back to the vill back to our little houses on our. M okay. <gasps> There's a treasure box. All right, go get your go get your lay down on. to that treasure box over there. This is gonna bug me. It's right there. Love the check in the daylight. It's hard to see anything here in the night. Very Final Fantasy with the music. I like it. I wonder if I get to, like, spruce up my shack at all. Like, make a better bed, get a new stove. Or, or if I'm going to wind up moving around in the world. Aw, she's so lonely, and she really likes me, and just wants to... Is he going to be with her? Jasper? Yes, it is. I mean, no! I know that not this individual of whom you speak. Um, then you are... Golden eyes like spotlights, illuminating the crime in the darkness. Fresh blood, a vivid treatment to the battle that had transpired. Tis none other than I, the Night Stalker. That's not a good name, dude. Is there anything you need, Mr. Night Stalker? Stalker? Words. You can't hide your any turmoil from me. Don't let these feelings of anguish pervade your life. Nay, take the advice of this night-capped cavalier, cavalier instead. You must never allow others to decide your fate for you. Should you ever disagree with the recommendation given to you, you must say so loud and clear. Disagree? I, um... I think there may have been some sort of misunderstanding, Jasper. I mean, Mr. Night Stalker. Misunderstanding? Whatever do you mean? I mean, it's... I didn't disagree with anything. Ah, I see. Then you were simply embarrassed, were you? I... I like John. A lot. You... 
like him? Is that I didn't didn't get that sense at all? But I do have to thank you, Mr. Night Stalker. Thank me. Yes, for what you've just said. Thank you, because you know what? I do need to take off my mask. There's no reason to be someone I'm not. Take off your mask. <clears throat> yes, yes, I can see now that I was worrying far too much. You can certainly take care of yourself. Now then, I shall bid you adieu. Until we meet next, my dear. Goodbye, Mr. Night Stalker. Goodness gracious, I nearly had a heart attack. That Uva is something else for that moment. I thought she'd be... She'd seen through my disguise. She did see through your disguise. Pretty sure she saw through it from the start. I'll say. That's... That's not possible. You don't think so, do you, Emily? I... Uh... Anyway... <laughs> Haven't you three had enough already? Uva clearly likes the guy. Had enough? You say that as though we don't have a moral obligation to watch over this village, village's youngins. I've said it once, and I'll say it again. You guys are nothing but a bunch of foggies. Watch your mouth. She doesn't have a point, you know. Perhaps we should leave the young sisters to deal with their own problems. I certainly didn't like having someone watching over my shoulder when I was young. Not you, too. Let's just give it a rest. Uva can certainly take care of herself. Very true. There isn't a man who wouldn't like Uva on this green earth. I will say, though, Jasper, that wasn't half bad. Getting Uva to finally say what's on her mind, I mean. That, I mean. It was all the work of the Night Stalker. There isn't a person in all the world capable of resisting the Night Stalker's charm. Okay. That's a really bad name. Like... We had a serial killer called the Night Stalker. Bruh. John! John! She yelling for me. John! Something big happened! Is there any way we can help Uva? When it comes to knocking a few heads, John's basically a master. Would you be willing to go to Blimpig Ranch? John Miller came over into the village this morning. Seems like poor Blimpigs have flown the coop. Bowman's already left to investigate, but I thought if there was anyone who could help it, it would be you, John! You really wanted to town on those Blimpigs yesterday. You don't think you scared them right off, do you? The blimp pigs are normally very docile. Something must have happened to spook them. Spook? 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 You don't think it was a monster, do you? I can't be sure. We don't usually tread too far into the forest. That's the mountain god's territory. Mountain god? Guess you and me will have to put those piggies back in their pen, John. Let's get to the blimp pig ranch. Quick! Uh, wait. The forest. It can be incredibly dangerous. Take this. It's not much, but... Should at least tap out against any beast you run into there. Is that a gun? You've got the bang bang gun. Very cool. Kind of a lame name, but cool. You haven't eaten breakfast yet, right? I made these sandwiches for you. You need to keep your strength up, you know. Yummy. Obtained fish sandwich. Look more like a squid sandwich, to be honest. How strange. You must have gone through quite a lot. There's even more colors in your memories than before. Ah! 
Okay, awesome. Defense! Green piggy. Something tells me. Tells me it's something bigger. Look at you going on like that. Ain't nothing but a little piggy escape. That's all. All we gotta do is find him again. No harm, no foul. Where he? Oh, Mr. Bowman's here too. Uba had something happened at the Blit Pig Ranch, so we thought we were. We'd drop by and see if we could help. Shh. Look at there. Oh, he big. That one! That's the little porky delinquent. You blockhead, you scared the little sucker right into the forest. Don't worry, we'll catch it. Just leave it to John. But the forest, it's dangerous. Yeah, you'll find more than a few wild critters in there. All the more reason why we're the perfect ones to do it. You should have seen John back underground. He was a monster whacking machine. Underground? Well, if you're that dead set, I ain't gonna stop ya. Hey! We're saying some game, you know. <laughs> but it is. Don't think they're planning on playing games by the looks of them. Looks the games involve deadly weapons. Wait, isn't that... Uva's gun? I may not know much about the old fisticuffs, but I don't... I do know that Uva's got a keen eye on us. She trusts ya. Well, then I trust ya. So go on, teach the bad piggy a lesson, and we won't soon forget. Aye, aye, just leave it to us. Just make sure ya... Watch your ammo. Without it, that thing ain't nothing but a rusty old stick. And don't be out too late. Harvest Festival's tonight. Whacking. And send it flying. Uh, eh, mm, but it's right there. It was right there. That's a tunnel. That's a bug. Pop up out of the ground? Oh yeah, what is that? Oh shit. Okay, I guess not. It's not a very good gun. I'm not really a fan of it. watching me. It keeps popping up randomly. We're rolling down the river. We're rolling, rolling, rolling down the river. That's the green piggy. Green as ever. Ooh, bitch, where do we wind up? What the fuck? 
Africa. What have I done? Where are we? Okay, we gotta turn on the electricity. Mmm, smack a whackin'. Boom, bitch. Secret door found. That wasn't really secret, it was pretty easy. Interesting. Aha! I see. Clever. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, I like that. I did that by accident. I totally just discovered that whole puzzle answer by mistake. So cool. What now? Are you serious? Get the fuck out of my way. Oh, I need those. My bad. Come on up. Come back up. Ugh. Need a key. Back the other way. Ugh. And then... Smack! That way. Oh yeah, look at that. Solving puzzles like a big boy. <laughs> She's, I'm not controlling her. Oh, I gotta keep that in mind. I didn't know that. I assumed it was just the first thing you were, you were controlling at the time. Okay, well, that's good to know. Key! I knew it was gonna be a key, and they're always keys. Anytime we find these little lockers, they always wind up being a fucking key. Oop! <laughs> Get the fuck out of my way, you stupid pots. It was awful. Ah! Thought I was gonna make it through. Stupid me. Stupid boy. <clears throat> Holy shit. Okay, guys. I have to use the restroom. I will be right back.
Okay, let's go ahead and eat some food. That is not what I meant to do. Pop up, come on. <clears throat> There's a lot more forest back there to go explore too, back at the beginning when we first got here. Oh my god, she can stop their electri- oh, okay, that's really dope. I didn't know she could stop their electricity. I can smack those back. <laughs> Cute. They did a really good job of capturing an apocalyptic world in this game. Like, they really did. Oh! So they tell me that's the way I'm supposed to be going, and I'm not ready to go the way I'm supposed to go yet. That just seemed very, like, this way. Oh, I guess not. This is the way we're supposed to be going. Well, then let's go back and check out the other way real quick. Do a bit of exploring while we're here. I'm sure there's a treasure box or two probably chilling out over there that I don't even know about, and I don't want to lose up. So let's go get it. him with his own bomb. Not even just, like, one of his teammates. I killed him with his own bomb. <laughs> I fucking love this game. <laughs> okay, worth the exploring. need to find two more of those treasure chests and we get a new heart. So worth it. I love that her her powers are stun. Like, that's how she kills him. She, like, stuns him. And then he can come in and, like, finish him off. Hold up. Where the fuck was that beetle? It's on this tree right here, but I couldn't see it. Ah, you lay those little shits, huh? So 
Gold. <laughs> we have so much salt in this game, like, <laughs> there's not a lot of places to shop quite yet. And where I can do most of my, I can get most of my healing supplies from cooking, I haven't really had to shop for much healing items. Which is good. I really, that's really cool. I like that. Because then I can save my money and who knows, maybe some rare things will come along. confused for a second. I was like, uh, oops. No! Let's try this out. Let's see what we get. Oh, we got two tomatoes. Gives you a little bit of a bonus. <laughs> I just love the music. Ooh, Oyakodon. Oyakodon? It's full. Okay. Let's rest in an apocalyptic home with no walls and monsters everywhere. So realistic. What's this? Ooh, the uh, ingredients. That's really depressing. Stop. I don't want to think about that. Fuck off. Because that's where, that's a world we're heading for. All fucking cutting down the trees. When is a forest so That's really depressing. this place. Monster? Ooh. What the fuck is that? I 
good shit. We did it! Okay, that was a fucking sick ass boss fight, and I fucking kicked ass. Did you see that? Pew pew pew! Pew 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 pew! Pew pew pew! pew. Drop bomb. Bitch, what? He didn't stand a chance. Cause my fly ass came in there and was like, bye motherfucking creeper! With the ribs and the face and the robot arms, all set! <laughs> What's that? Let you go. After everything you did? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That's your girlfriend. But the fence, you smashed it to smithereens. You won't do it again? Are you sure she can talk to it? Oh, John, he knows what he did was wrong. He won't do it again. Should we let him go? Okay. Fucking vibe in. Bye bye, Mr. Naughty Pig. Huh? From the mountain cave. Well, let's head up up in there, bitch. Okay, thanks, Mr. Naughty Pig. Huh. It's gone. Well, rude. Seems like a dungeon. I don't like it here, John. Let's not stay here long. Okay. Alright, guys. Give me one second. My coffee's ready. Hold on one minute.
gives us superiority or superiority complex. Oh, the one that's weird, the one we saw in Epping was 14. Where, which one were you looking at? It might, it might also be depending on who owns it, too. That's, that's what I was gonna say, it might be a main location. That's not bad. I was gonna say, I'd fucking flip burgers for $17 an hour. Oh guys, okay guys, I'm back. My coffee is made, it is delicious, and I am ready to continue on. Well, I can't believe we found this. I'm curious to know what this all is. Okay, so we can't use our weapons, it seems. So there shouldn't be any combat here. It looks like an old warehouse? Or like an old lab or something? It's still active. What the fuck? <gasps> oh, ew! Ew, it's watching me. It's watching me. Yeah, what is this? Leaving so soon. You again. What are you doing? Something that must be done. Can you help us get out of here? We need to get back to Greenberg. You want to leave? Of course, tonight's the Harvest Festival. Harvest Festival. I see. We want to come too? It's going to be so much fun. Me? Yes. Yes, I believe I will join the Harvest Oh. What the fuck? There's a brain in that jar over there. What is happening? <laughs> Back up, Ibri- <sighs> Is she a test tube baby? Welcome back, <coughs> mother. <coughs> what the fuck? <coughs> I don't like this at all. <coughs> Is that a person? in the fucking what in the almighty fuck is happening here huh oh I think it must be going out I didn't turn it off we must need to refill it already I was gonna turn it off here in a few minutes it was getting warm in here a human. Something you see every day, this isn't. It's a breeder bot. Oh my god, they're growing fucking... They're growing babies! Okay, this game, this game just went from creepy to like... In, I mean, like, cute, quirky, and kind of dark to like super fucking dark. Haha, <laughs> remember that one for later, I shall. But more importantly, that half-baked half guard slacking off he must be. Oh, already here you are. <clears throat> Frieder bot, I am. Leave this place, you shall. Ahead of schedule, you are. Make adjustments, I must. 
Late it is, begin soon, the harvest will. Hurry back, you must. To miss this, most inconvenient would it be. What the fuck, guys? This is some twisted ass shit right here. This is like Matrix level shit right here. I knew this game was gonna have dark tones, but like, whoa! Where are we? Oh! This is where we emerged from the train station. Right? Yeah! Oh, we're back here again. This is where it came out? Interesting. Something seems different. There's no music. Here we go. Oh, he's gone. I don't like this. Something happened. But what? You're not hurt, are you? The forest here can be da Oh, okay. I guess not. He told me he won't cause any more trouble. He told you? Sure did with his own mouth. Ah, how wonderful. Come, we'll go see the wood whale. Everyone's waiting for you. I think I missed a, a punctuation in there somewhere. Yes, I'll save my- You're so fucking dark! Tomorrow's the day of the harvest. Harvest? What's that, huh? That's where we bring in the ripe crops from our fields. Those crops will become your our food for the next year. It's a very important event for the village. Sounds kind of like the Sunnyside Ranch. But what about the unripe ones, huh? What do you do with those? Oh, well, I suppose we'll burn them together with the straw. But burn them? It's all right. Next year, a new batch will sprout on top of them. John, did you hear that? All those poor crops. You're a very compassionate girl, you know that, Sam? Come on, shall we go inside? The party will start soon. And the whole town's here! It's like a moment out of Stardew Valley. It's John! Don't tell me you already forgot! Yo, goop! Oh, ho, ho, ho! Yes, yes, John! Of course! I heard the two of you are quite handy to have around the ranch. <coughs> they ain't my words, no siree. Oh, really? Then who was it showering that new John fella with praise? <coughs> He won't say it, but he's absolutely pleased as punch. Oh, perfect, perfect. Then join us, brave visitors from afar, as we give thanks to the mountain god with a grand feast. Yay, it healed me. 
Hey, you guys. It's time for that. That. Oh, goody. I love that. Everything ready. Oh, a group photo! Let's see, let's see. Huh? What's going on? Oh, it's time for one of our most important ceremonies, the Shadow Box Ceremony. <coughs> well, we started by standing close together, then we shout out the name of the God of Cheese, after which <coughs> he'll help us record this moment for all of eternity. The God of Cheese? Oh, wow, that sounds so cool! A God of Cheese? Pretty dope. John, come on, make a cool pose. God of cheese! Wait, not yet. Ready? God of cheese, we're counting on ya. One, two, three. Oh my, oh my, what's going on? Suddenly I can't see a thing. What in the world just happened? The kid, she... she blow it up? I've never seen anything like it before. I know what that was. That was a flash. A flash? Surely the shadow box ceremony will turn out much clearer now. Praise be, the mountain god must be pleased as punch this year. Yeah, she has, like, energy manipulation, so she probably, like, charged the flash in the camera and didn't even know it. Pleased as punch, indeed. I'm happy we came to the surface too, sweetie. I love how, like, even, like, the non-major important town people are, like, fully, like, written out. Like, they have personalities, they have dialogue, I can sit and talk to them, even though it's not necessarily story important. Like, this is really... Wow, Chucklefish. Just wow. I'm I'm blowing away. I'm blown away by this game. And honestly, a lot of the games that they put out I wind up loving. There's just oh my god, they're just so talented. They know how to capture the nostalgia without making reboots and remakes, you know? Which I don't hate either, if it's done right, like the Final Fantasy VII reboot. Oh my god, I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Um, I need to get a PS5 so I can play the Yuffie story. But unfortunately, I can't get my hands on a PS5 because nobody has them. this? True Demon, the Demon King's final form. The experiment starts tomorrow. Luckily, with a bit of crunch, I was able to finish this game first. Oh, I just got him? He's a top prize. These are used in that dragon game. The Earthborn. can come over here and now go click on that and see what he does. The Demon King's 
stuns all enemies. I really like that the refrigerators say, like, insightful things like that. Like, that's kind of cool. <laughs> Hmm, Josh, I'm tired of walking. John. Alright, come get on my back, kiddo. Is she just gonna drop me home? Because I really don't want to walk all that way. It's kind of irritating that there's no shortcut or anything, you know? John! What is she? What does Uva want? I'm I'm so glad you've come to the festival. She's so into me. Well, John. <coughs> huh? <coughs> Blimping chops. So precious. If only I could have a child like her. Heavens to Betsy. What's gotten into me? Oh, I got her girly parts all gurgling. She wanting babies. Oh, this is so cute. If they don't wind up together by the end of this game, I'm going to be so sad. So breakfast at her place tomorrow. Got it. Blimping chops. I fucking love Sam. She's such an adorable little girl character. She's so well written. Oh. Max hearts increased. What doesn't kill you just disappoints me. I love this sweater. I ordered it from one of those, like, websites that's here. But, like, they get it from, like, overseas. Like, China, Japan. Like, they get for the stuff from over there. And I fucking love it. I had to order. I ordered it in a large... Um, and honestly, it fits everywhere but the arms, and then the arms, and what I mean by it is, like, it does, it's not tight, but it's, like, short. It falls, like, just above the wrist. So I should have gotten an extra large. It was also, I think it might have been in the female section, but it was, like, listed as unisex. It kind of is. I mean, the hood has little ears on it, so, but other than that, like, it's totally a unisex sweater. I just should have gotten extra large. I always know to order big on those websites, and I just didn't. Oh, well. Anyway, it still fits. It's cute, and I love it. <laughs> Plus, I'm trying to replace some of my old sweaters and long sleeve shirts and stuff with some newer ones, because... What is happening? This is so weird. That's another train. I'm having a dream. Um, but I have so many clothes, and I need to, like, get rid of them, because a lot of them are old. I just need to freshen up my wardrobe and replace some of my old shirts that don't even really fit properly anymore, or I just don't wear. I have so many, so many t-shirts. <laughs> Uh-oh, what is happening? That train, it showed that train and now things are... Oh! Oh my! Oh, what is ha what is happening? <gasps> Who's that? Hello? Looks like a sword. Anyone there? Oh my god. Can they join my team? Can I like... 
too late again. Who's there? Great, you're still alive. You need to get yourself to the station. The miasma is coming. Come back. The village, it's... No, just leave the village to me. You get to the train station as fast as you can. What are you waiting for? I have to grab the little girl, you dumbass. I don't feel good, John. That, that kid. You can still make it through the forest to the south. Hurry, you need to get back to the station. Carry her if you have to. What is happening? Hurry, you can still make it out through the forest to the south. Go, John, now. And don't look back. Just leave the village to me. We're saving it in case something happens. Maybe that train brings the miasma? Oh. weird. It's almost like the glowing on her is like auto clearing them up. grabbed it! I pressed A to retrieve it! Well, I can't go up. <gasps> oh my god. <gasps> oh shit! no clue what I'm doing right now. This is going to be very stressful. Oh, <gasps> my gun! It's faster. Booyah. That's how we get through this. This is so fucking crazy. Very tense. 
I like this, but I, it's, it's very, very stressful. <laughs> and I have to go to the bathroom like it's nobody's business right now. Get the fuck out of my way. Oh, almost did not make it through there. <gasps> nope, we fucked up. We're done. It's over. I done fucked up. Yeah, I done fucked up. We're dead. Reset current level. I have to hit the revolving thing and I didn't realize that. That's right, I need to do it with a bomb. Fucking A. So much to do. This puzzle is, like, really stressful. And I don't like that I have to come to a complete stop before my it'll register my, um, swipe. <gasps> I see. Not good, not good, not good. Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Holy shit. I thought for sure we were not going to make it out of there because I, I didn't know where to go first a fucking quick second. I was like having a panic attack there for a minute. Fuck off, my asthma. Oh my god, we made it. <gasps> no, we didn't. Girl, what's she doing? So it comes to this, does it? <clears throat> Not bad. Then I suppose it's my turn. I think we're two people. In one, like, split personalities, and I think... She can do something different than what I can. Fresh air, my old friend. I haven't moved like this in quite some time. Great! You earned Energy Blast! I wonder if that'll damage enemies. 
show yourself. Mmm, the breeder bot. Mother! Has it begun? Ready to go, everything is. Already started, the harvest has. This umbral scent, the memories it stirs. Come! Ma'am. And take him with you. Ma'am. Okay. Holy shit, what the fuck is going on? St ever since we found that place, things have gotten nuts here. What the fuck? That's far enough. Leave us. B but, Mother... <clears throat> enough! <clears throat> Your services are no longer required. Damn. Bye, bitch. As she said, bye. Go. You know what? This this game might all of a sudden qualify for a month of monstrosities because holy shit, this just got mad weird and dark. Wicked dark. I must return to save them. Let it go already. There's nothing left there. Nothing. Be gone, you! You Melibra scoundrel! Bushwhacker! Hoodlum! Ruffian! Call me all the names you want. You need to get those two on the train while there's still time. Those two? <sighs> I wonder who that is. <coughs> I'm incredibly interested in that character. I was kind of hoping for a second I was going to move as Jasper. <coughs> Just for fun for a few seconds, but whatever. <gasps> oh my god, look at that! The train speeds away. The lights of the railroad signals have red, red streaks across the black night. The miasma laps at the sides of the steep cliff like a tireless mountain climber. The factory has been activated. Soon, Greenberg will become its new residence. Will welcome its new residence. What? The fuck? Um. Holy shit. We got the nightmare achievement. To be continued in fucking deed. This is the perfect place to stop. The perfect. I just need to save it. <coughs> John! Finally, I thought you'd never wake up. Look! Look, look, look! Outside! It's beautiful! gotta be somewhere I can save it. A young girl of a goldest locks had brought me there. Below me, as far as the eye could see, was nothing but black. Black as the night, black as death. That was when the young woman spoke to me. There's no one left. It was all my fault. It was all my fault. If only I'd... If only I hadn't run. If only... I'd gone back. Gone back to save everyone. I should have died with them. That's what I thought to myself. But then... 
Then I saw you two. You two must have also suffered greatly. When I saw you at the train station, you looked as though you just returned from a mighty battle. We had... Wouldn't seem Sam has no recollection of what happened. It's for the best, I suppose. A child like her shouldn't be made to express such things. Experience. Okay, I want to... I think it's... I think it's saved. I'm gonna check. Pretty sure it's saved at the end of chapter... Chapter one, uh, that last chapter. Or episode, whatever they call them in this one. This game is insane. I'm... I just... I can't with this game right now. So much amazing is happening. I just want to go to load real quick. Yeah, it last saved. Okay, cool. Alright, guys. So this is the perfect spot to call it. it hits that two-hour mark. Um, I was going to go for three... But um, the boyfriend has to go and get his car inspected today and figure out what it's going to take to repair from his car accident over last winter. Um, wasn't super serious. There was just some minor cosmetic damage. Well, not minor. Some cosmetic damage, and we're going to get it fixed. Um, but uh, other than that, um, so that was it for today, guys. Um, some shit happened. Holy crap, I love this game. Um, so... Tomorrow is Sunday, which means I'll be live at 12. Um, if everybody is available tomorrow, I will be live with either um, Visage or The Beast Inside. Uh, possibly more Dying, Dagen Ranpa. Or some, and uh, definitely might squeeze in some Cozy Grove, since what like there's only a few missions you can do in a day, and then the, you're done for the day. We might do some of those and get them knocked out of the way. But um, yeah, either way, tune in tomorrow, guys. Uh, it'll be fun. It'll be out of the way. It's always a good time. I will see you guys then. Bye.